back in the fray, as Caesars would say. So this time, I got to leave work at 5. Just like yesterday, that feels so good. Usually I leave work at 6, that motherfucking 5 hour shift is killer. But 4 hours? Man, that makes my dick hard every time. This piano in this track is really upbeat. Sounds like something an old man would play. Like from the 1920s. Okay. So I gotta go to Taco Village. I don't remember where that is, but... I just go to every village I've ever went to until I get to it. So I'm not sure if his attack went down by 20 points, his weapon skill. I suck at memorizing these things, but I felt like it was 100 something, not 80 something. But regardless, I'm gonna keep him, I'm gonna keep Wheezy as a knight, since I feel that's where he belongs for now. Flame cave. Okay. Ew, how did I sneeze on my phone? It's disgusting. Nobody touch my phone from now on. Argus Castle. Okay, now I know exactly where I need to be. I say exactly for emphasis, but then watch, I'm gonna be somewhere stupid. I didn't do a grinding session yesterday because of the boss we're about to face. By the way, I'm not looking forward to fighting that boss. That boss is a puzzle boss. So let's see if he gets a new attack multiplier. See, already I'm being stupid, just trying to understand this world map. The world map design on this game is, by the way, very creative. Like, this shit is mad weird. Damn, you see that? Five hits. said back the fuck up but I like that so next time I'll get another attack multiplier it'll probably be somewhere around I don't know, 'm I think about it that's not too bad man these look like a combination of two Scorpio signs it's like Taurus which is me and some other shit Gary the snail Hmm. Mentally, I should be preparing for the next boss fight, but, eh. I am grinding right now because I don't know where the hell I'm going. I'm not about to run from battles in this game. 
This is not a run from battles game. But since I can soapbox about this game some more, seeing as we're having some downtime, I've done some more research about the remake that I played 10 years ago. So here's what I'm trying to understand. They still don't give you save points or an opportunity to save outside the world map. You would think if someone made a reproduction of the game, that the first thing that they would do is... I don't know, take away some of the artifice in the difficulty. Damn. But man, if you know about this game, you know about the final dungeon. That's the part of the game where you're like, I right, after you get to it, just stop playing the game. You beat the game. I'm just trying to brace myself for it. Like I'm thinking about it right here, right now. This early on in the game. That's how much anxiety it's giving me. Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. But yeah, the encounter rate in the water is actually kind of intense if you think about it. Damn. He just said, fuck that, I'm going to kill your ass. Like, I don't want your money, I want your life. I was thinking it would be to the east this whole time. It's to the west. No, I mean, I was thinking it would be to the west, but it's to the east. I should have said I should have taken... Fuck. I botched that joke the hell up. Like, I should have, I thought that was going to be to the west, but it's to the east. Hmm. So I just got to take a trip down until I get to Tockle. And that's it, that's Tockle. Remember, from the last episode, Wheezy took all the EXP, so that's why he's 700 ahead. So now I'm thinking, like, how much until they're on his level? So him, it's not that much of a trip, but what about everyone else? Only Breezy's got a trip, but I'm not too worried about him. The only one I want to reach that 17 is maybe Yeezy. And Drizzy. Gotta have them in jail during a Square Enix RPG. I'm surprised Prison Break wasn't done by Square Enix or Soft. Prison Break low key became my favorite show, like a season by season television drama.
Okay, luck mallet. This shit type funny. I don't care. I'm walking around mad little. Are you sure there's any tr hidden treasures to the right of me? So I'll get into an optional battle if I'm here. You know, I kind of want to get into that battle. Oh, so that was a preemptive for me. That could have been a waste of time right there. Okay, now I'm being a dumbass. It'd be nice if this game had a memory cursor instead of having everything be manual. Stop getting my homies shook. One hit? No hit? Oh no, he's not shook, he's sleep. You like hypnotize his ass. That's that eye fixation shit. Speaking of which, I saw that video a couple of days ago of Tila trying that. And I'm thinking like, she could pull it off, but she's never done a proper attempt, which it's been like four years since she's pseudo done it. And since she started at least. And she still ain't doing it. So I can go here if I try to be little again. <clears throat> Should I? Hell no. It's not worth it. There's got to be another way to get to there. Come on. One of you just has to hit him. There. 
Breezy put in that work. It's funny that Breezy's probably the most useless party member. Situationally, at least. But in terms of the artists I'm referencing, he's probably my favorite. Because Lil Wayne, I like his personality. I haven't really listened to any of his newer stuff. Or even his stuff from when he was still relevant. Uh, Kanye, I don't know. And Drizzy, his old stuff is pretty nice, but after his third album, I just stopped caring. I think a big reason for that is that he just keeps jacking other artists shit <laughs> let me talk about how Drake just steals other people's songs or well, not steals other people's songs but he has a ghostwriter but whoever his ghostwriter is is a freaking plagiarist but Last album, before this one, he was trying to be Trini. Now he's trying to do some British grime rap. Spanish Drake was already getting me apprehensive, but... You gotta have some limitations. Some standards. I might have to do it. Oh no. That's not like a hidden passageway. So, which one do I take first? I'm not gonna front. The enemies here aren't too bad yet. Like, of course, they probably have some annoying tricks up their sleeves. Damn, Breezy? Damn, Yeezy? Like, y'all just going in right now. And that's what I was expecting. I was expecting them to, like, show me how things can get nasty here. They got them on Confused. Matter of fact, I should have had Drizzy, like, hit this guy. Okay, only two connected. Good, good. See, that's some nasty shit. When they turn Ed, or they catch feelings, they get thirsty. That's the worst. And that reminds me, Final Fantasy Tactics, it was nice to play an RPG where you could do that to other people and have it be viable. And the wrong person turns out. Damn. Damn. Just damn in general. This battle has taken the life out of me, man.
که Did I buy any like uh, healing items? I didn't, which is really dumb. Like, Okay, do I take it to the left or to the right? Okay, there's a door to the far left which just has some... No, the door to the left has some whack shit, like 130 gil. So good luck, guide. I'm glad I'm starting to use this now. Just because I know this game likes to mess with you. So this is an optional battle I would have gotten into if I had escaped from that side of the cell. Damn. Breezy took what I said about him to heart. He's like, you said I'm whack? I don't know, whack, watch this. King, that's what I am. No, I know there's some stuff like... Okay, so it's okay. Usually people use guides to go to the right way. I'm using it to go to the wrong way. Ah, that was silly of me. I sound like my boss now. Okay. Okay, so now I'm going to be doing 100 in terms of attack. That's wavy. Oh, hell no. I hate these bitches. <laughs> uh, good, good, man. But why ain't nobody put in work? Finally, like... Okay, carefully now, because I know this is the last guy. If I hit this, this is not too weak, and it's not going to ask me, are you sure? So, I right, Drizzy, go before Yeezy. Okay, come on, go hard. I'm sleep. I don't care. <laughs> go ahead.
keep him confused. Hmm. What about high potions? Okay, so I got three of them. Hmm. Yeah, these guys are pretty annoying. Oh, hell no. Come on. There's someone hit Wheezy or Yeezy. Okay, awake. Oh no, he's still asleep? Good thing Breezy lowered some of the weight. Okay, I can accept that. Yeah. What the hell? When? Okay. Good. Uh, yeah, I got this. I'm slurring, slurring my, like a motherfucker right now. <laughs> Y'all would think I'm actually shook. Like the stakes are higher than they actually are. Okay, so I'm gonna heal him first. So there's a potion around here somewhere, right? No. This dungeon is type treacherous, like, I ain't even going front. Take care of them first. Like, you want to have priorities? And we got to strike first, that's good. You see, his glare doesn't actually, like, confuse you. It just puts you to sleep. 
which is temporary and doesn't have as much consequences or at least not as dire in general <clears throat> good, good. See, for mob attacks, as long as you're not AoEing it, that's pretty good. Good. That's what I'm just seeing now. Good. I don't know. Now we can focus on her. See, that crit really came in handy. I have more bows, and it's not really what I'm looking for, but... It don't really matter. All right. Come on. Don't let the whole world go before you. Yo. Now that was good. That was real good.
Right, so this is where I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I have an emulator. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to do a save state. And save states aren't really useful for RNG manipulation on their own you gotta do some extra stuff but I'm not about to get screwed out of this now you can make this battle a little easier with your scholars but I kinda need the manpower at the moment and a healer You know who this guy reminds me of? He reminds me of one of the bosses from Shin Megami Tensei 3, Matador. Okay. Hmm. So that's his weakness. Well, let's see if it is. Oh yeah, this guy is really resistant to physical attacks. He'll dodge a lot of them. Hmm. Does that mean he's over it? Because I know he changes his weakness after three turns. Okay, one of those hits landed. Oh no, that was his weakness, no. Unless he changed into his weakness. So now you come out? Okay, so they've been freed from their Mind control, I guess. And some of them were prisoners, I guess. But it sure was kind of quick for you to pull through. This is looking like a music montage right now. Like that What Is Love music video. Ah, man. Yeah, this is really giving me a mono game vibe. In fact, this whole game gives me a Saiken and Setsu vibe. So, was I supposed to go to the west of that or east? Man, I don't even know, boy.
Okay, so I'm just gonna go back to my shit. <laughs> Common sense, right? So I wonder how weak these guys should be now. Cause if you think about it, I got my attack multiplier now. Now I used to take a hot ass minute to grind these guys. I think confront that boss wasn't as hard as I expected. Although I did get lucky. And the mob enemies and my lack of preparation were biting me in the ass. So Are you guys a town again? Can I buy shit from ya? So you guys aren't gonna have like a thriving market anytime soon. This place is just gonna be a bunch of chicken spots and... Bodegas. Yeah, I'm not so bothered by that. I yo, let me get a chopped cheese, Ock. Um. Was that too much? Oh well, I might be grinding soon anyway. <laughs> so it turns out Desh was a Dragoon. I'm thinking about him just because I remember Back when I would go to this inn, Desh would be napping with my ass right next to me, but that guy was a Dragoon, like Ricard and Kane. Would have been nice to have him as a guest party member who can actually fight if that was the case. But when I think about RPGs, it really put that Yggdrasil plot point to its max. Man, Tales of Symphonia. I had a lot of fun playing that shit last year. How much until my bad boy knight gets his level up? Oh damn, they're on their way to becoming level 18. I didn't even know. I should have figured, but I didn't. I was going to use the chocobo, but if they're that close, might as well go manually. Actually, I'm going to be on the ship, which has encounters, which means that's kind of pointless. But I need to get the money up for my characters anyway, because I spend a lot of that on high potions and potions. Damn, <laughs> that just sounded violent. Could you imagine if Final Fantasy still had attack multipliers? 
Uh, there would be no need for a limit break. Just put everyone on haste. Watch him just go in. Okay. Why am I looking at the map? Like, I've never gone here before. Is it Argus or Argris? Or Argrass? Such an uncomfortable true swine. But as soon as I saw that round table, I knew we would have to go through a quest to get this back to booming. Say no more. You see, I bet you in the remake, they would have made that really confusing, but I know Kanan, and I know Sid, and I remember that, and they gave us clear directions.